is Vevra Studios and welcome back. Today we are going to be playing a little bit of Prisoner Architect or Prison Architect. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. Um I don't really know what else to say. Um we're currently building our classrooms. I've gotta go ahead and get my power set up and it looks like I've gotta hook up a cable right there, that's fine. I'll go ahead and place that down and what the hell? Why did it do that? Why are it, why? <laughs> I, I don't like how this game just randomly decides to put hole, holes and shit. Like, it, it just does that. It decides where it wants to put holes and then it just puts them there. It doesn't give a flying shit if every... Oh, there's a dead guy. Anyways, we're going to go ahead and uh, clone our classroom. Okay. That goes in the top. That'll go down here. Right? I believe so. Hope I did that right. What the hell is that? What is that? Construct dirt? What the fuck? Huh? What? Okay, I'm gonna manually place down the desks? What the fuck? I don't know. I'm confused. I don't know. It's it's. What the fuck is this shit? Construct dirt? Why would I want to construct dirt? I don't know what the hell all that crap was. See, what is this too? Why are there students? What the balls? Okay. Okay. Now let's let's. <laughs> I'm just gonna manual place those. I don't know what the fuck just happened with my cloning tool there. It just freaked the balls out. Okay. And then, I believe, office desk right there. Uh... Okay. And then a phone buff. Right there, and I'm gonna cancel that there, there. Put the phone boots down here. Right next to the doors. Okay, so that should turn out all right. That should turn out more than all right. Ooh, looks like we just found poison on someone. I guess that's kind of be uh, kind of to be expected. We assigned a ton of janitors, so they pretty much have easy access to bleach. Although they can't really use that to uh, to their advantage too much, so that that's kind of good. Um, also, the solitary doors still open. I don't know how the fuck to get them shut. If I keep them locked shut, uh, they'll just be locked shut. And I put them on normal, and they're just I don't know. They're all fucked up, but the prisoners don't seem to mind, so <laughs> we'll just leave them in there. Ooh, found a drill on someone. Yeah, we're finding a lot of narcotics, or not real necessarily uh, narcotics, but we're finding a lot of uh, tools and stuff, and I don't like to see that shit. I don't mind finding narcotics or something. Prisoners can't escape with that shit, but I do mind finding tools, because prisoners can't escape with that shit. I mean, you're really not going to see someone trying to escape out of prison with a freaking pack of cigarettes. It doesn't it doesn't really work that way. Uh, feed prisoners. Okay, that's fine. Uh, wait for funds. Yeah. So this should help out with our foundation course. Uh, programs. Is this... Okay, workshop safety induction, drug addiction, okay. Kitchen safety and hygiene. Ooh, found shears. Um, I want to start another one of these. There we go. And then general education course. Is anybody qualified for that? One person is inter interested and qualified. Uh, ten people want... Parole hearings? Do I... Spiritual guidance! Let's do that! Where's that? Where'd it go? Oh, okay, that takes place in the chapel. We can do that. Death row appeal. <laughs> well, we don't have anyone on death row yet, so... 
parole hearing? Where does that take place? Six to ten. Kitchen safety and hygiene. Where does that go? Takes place in the kitchen, 10 to 12. We can do that. So we'll start up a bunch of programs here. That'll really help out uh, our prison and our prisoners. That'll definitely help out all around. That'll be really great. Ooh, searching some peoples. Didn't find anything. Looks like our cooks are still cooking up some bacon for uh, for later. We might need to expand and make another cantina, possibly over here somewhere, eventually. Uh, yeah, we'll probably have to do that. Eventually make another cantina, because this one's getting pretty damn full, so we're going to need another one. And I'd also like to, uh, I'd also like to set up a, a, uh, another area, another, uh, a high security area to be uh to be exact possibly in this bottom left corner I could set up a nice little area maybe i'll actually uh maybe i'll actually fence something out right now um let's see okay so let's fence let's fence something out right now um i want this right Hey, why do you autosave? Don't autosaving me like that. Okay, so we'll put it like that. Like that. And then that'll go all the way over to that fence. And this fence will come down to there. And this goes down. Like okay. So, this whole bottom left area will be our high security area. And maybe we can get in some high security prisoners and there's a goddamn fly on my wall. That's annoying. <laughs> ah, you gotta love summer, right? Well, anyways, most of our prisoners are sleeping, so I'll come back in the morning when everyone is awake. What's happening over here? Is this guy... Oh, he's overdosed. Okay, that's not good. Anyways, see you guys in the morning. Hey guys, welcome back. It is now just about time for our prisoners to wake up and take their showers and then eat their breakfast. Um, this is basically what I've done um, for the high security area. I haven't really built too much and I'm probably not going to build anything in here for a little bit. Um, but what I what I did build is this and this is going to become my, uh, my generator room. Let me go ahead and fix up these walls so we can go ahead and place the generator now although i'm not gonna spend any any uh money on that any uh any money on the capacitors yet because that's gonna be goddamn expensive but um yeah that is going to be our that is gonna be our power hub for this whole bottom left area, and it should be enough. I shouldn't even have to get full around capacitors. Maybe, maybe only four tops. Um, hopefully, you know we won't have to use a lot, and it won't cost us a lot of money. But yeah, and then also over here, I'm gonna build another security area and a staff restroom, or you know a staff rest area, and then I'll probably have some recreation areas out here, and then high security prison areas you know, strewn out throughout there. We'll, we'll, we'll get to the design of that, uh, later on. But, um, what I want to do is we actually have a, a, a big space over here that isn't being utilized. So what I want to go ahead and do is make a door right there and right there. And then I want to assign this outside area as, where is it? 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 Um, yard. I'm gonna assign this outside air outside area as a yard, and then we will put in some exercise machines, as always. And this will be a little, um, a little yard out behind the cafeteria. So that way our prisoners will have a, a, a separate yard to go to, if they so please. Because the other one's going to get really crowded, especially with uh, all the new prisoners that we're getting. 
So that's going to be hella expensive for all those phone boots. Oh, yes. Very, very expensive. Maybe I shouldn't have bought that many, but whatever. Whatever, our, our, our prisoners need phone booths. So that'll that'll be the new yard area for our prisoners. Because there's a bunch of unused space right there, so why not? And I'll also, um... When I build the fence... When the fe Whoa! Fights! Oh, yeah. Everyone's pissed. Hopefully no one dies here. Hopefully no one dies here. I'm gonna take a screenshot. This is good action. Boom, you're on the news. All right, well, it looks like they're done fighting, at least for now. Um, maybe I'll hire a few more guards. Two more guards. Actually, hold on, let's see. Now I'll hire four more guards. Now I'll set my daily cash flow at about 5,000, which isn't too bad. Not too bad at all. We definitely do need some more money, though. So, yeah. They'll get done with their showers, they'll eat, and then hopefully everyone won't be so pissed off. Yep, now they're going to eat. $40 food tray, what? Oh, someone just got tased again. It's probably up here. Oh, getting tased again. Yeah, they're all pissed off. They haven't gotten their freaking granola bars in yet. So they're all pissed off. We should also build another infirmary uh, on this side of the prison. Maybe we should do that right now. Build another infirmary. Um, yeah, yeah. Let's let's put up another infirmary over here. Uh, we'll do 15 by 16, so in between that, right there. <coughs> and that'll be our, um, our infirmary. I don't think we actually need to hook up water in there. I think we just need power for the lights, so I'm just gonna have a power line running in there. And that'll be it for that room. Um, I, I, I don't know if we're using all of our classrooms. I think we have all of our classrooms utilized. Hopefully we do. Pharmacological, safety, guard taser, spiritual guidance. Yeah, um, I think we have foundation. What about this? Oh, okay. I guess not enough prisoners are interested to start that. Um, uh, can we start another one of these? Yes, we can. Another one? Oh, oh, it only takes up... Okay, we can only have one per infirmary. Okay. Um, alright. Then I guess we can't do that. Um... Spiritual guidance, general... Behavioral therapy... Psychologist's office. We can do that. We can do a, a behavioral therapy. Why not? Why not? Parole hearings. I thought I had parole. No, I took this off. I remember. Okay, anyways, that's enough of dealing with those programs. Costing us a fair bit of money, but I think it's going to be well worth it. Definitely well worth it. Um, deployment, I would like to have one guard. Ooh, what the fuck did I just do? This whole area? What the fuck? No, take that off. Never mind. We need to wait for them to install that fence over there. And then we can assign police to the yard. Anyways, we're going to put it on fast forward. Everyone's happy now. They usually get pissed off in the morning because, you know, they haven't had their granola bars. So that'll definitely piss a prisoner off. Oh, yeah. Look at these badasses work out, man. Working tirelessly. Yeah, they're gonna give our, they're gonna give our security staff uh, a hard time. Oh boy. But yeah, that's not that's not good. That's not funny. I wasn't laughing at that. How the fuck did a prisoner get back there? God damn. Oh, I guess he was trying to look for his class. Oh boy. Ooh, found a shank on somebody. There goes that generator.
Um, I think I might. Oh man, I want to assign. Let's let's assign a guard right here, and let's have him go up here. So a guard will patrol up and down that area. Yeah, we're finding stuff left and right now since we have such a huge prison. I'm thinking of actually lightening the, um, lightening the punishments. Destruction. Escape attempt. That's going out. Fuck people who try to escape. Fuck them. Okay. I think we'll, uh, yeah, I think we'll go ahead and do that. Um, we'll lower a few of the sentences. Because, I mean, the longer they're in solitary, the more pissed off they're going to get, pretty much. Um, you just need them in there for a long enough time so that way they get, uh... So that way they get, uh, what's it called? Suppressed, yes, that is it. You just want them in there for, uh, you know, just a tiny bit so they'll, they'll get suppressed. <clears throat> That's pretty much what you want. Ooh, what do they find? Oh, more pills. Yeah, pills galore. Our canines are doing good work, though. They're finding a lot of shit. A lot of shit. Yeah, our, our canine units are doing great. Um, and our walls are messed up again. Hate how that does that when, when it's up against fences. What was I gonna... Oh, yeah, I was gonna make this uh, an infirmary. And then we can start dealing with our drug problem. Oh, yeah, we're also gonna want to make a morgue. Maybe I'll make that in the high, the high security area. As a special sort of a present, if you will. Uh, we could also make another visitation area. That would actually be quite worthwhile. Um, executions. I wouldn't mind having an executions room. We'll probably have that in high sec uh, down there. <coughs> We're not going to get to building that for a while, though. I got to stock up on the monies before I can actually invest in that area of my prison so we're gonna need some uh medical beds and we're also gonna need to hire a few more doctors we'll, we'll do that after we get to our uh medical beds here so we'll get one two three uh we'll four we'll four we'll do four and then uh da -da -da -da, two doctors And there's that. Yeah, we're, we're definitely going to want to accept a, a few more prisoners here. Um, what's actually... Can we accept three more prisoners? How much will we get paid for that? 300 each? Can I only take three? Yes, I can only take three. Okay, I'll take three low inmates. Or, or let's do... Let's do medsec. We'll do three... Oh, I can't punch it. Oh, okay, there we go. We'll do three uh, med sack guys. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that. And then we'll fill up our prison completely. And that'll, that'll be good. Excuse me. Yeah, we'll have to we'll have to put put up another block, cell block. And finding tools left and right, not good at all. But then again, we have a hundred prisoners, so I guess that's kind of to be expected. How are our needs looking? Oh, people want sleep, but I guess it is the end of the day. So our needs are actually getting dealt with pretty well. Um, we could hire one more janitor. I don't want to hire too many more. I still want to be making a decent amount of profit. Um, I don't actually think I need to hire guards any anytime soon, though. We have a ton. I think I think I went a little bit overboard with the guards, to be quite honest. So yeah, well there we go. We have a we have a second infirmary, which I think means we can initiate another uh, pharmacological treatment. Yes, we can. Okay, so we'll do that just so we can help deal with our drug problem because 
that's definitely going to be a driving force for escaping and driving up our our prisoners on happiness so we definitely want to get that problem dealt with and it looks like everyone's returning for their dinner their din dins everyone needs clothing uh maybe we need to make a second laundry area Yeah, we'll, we probably need to make a second um, laundry area. Maybe, maybe we'll make it. Uh, maybe we'll make it over here. I don't know. That's a bit big for a laundry area, though. Maybe, maybe only that big. And then have another building, maybe. Huh? I wonder what I'll make. Oh, yeah, I could have uh, visitation. Although that's that's this is really far in for visitation. All right, well we'll have visitation. That's really far in for visitation. Oh boy, people visiting are gonna be scared. Um, so visitation, I guess. <laughs> oh boy, that <laughs> that would not be a very good idea in a real prison. Um, don't do that. Uh, um, yeah, but this is a game, so who cares? So, we'll, we'll go ahead, run up our stone, stone flooring, and, uh, what did I put a, did I put a, okay, just regular door. Okay, that might actually be part of the problem, might be part of the problem in the sense that people could just walk in the laundromat. Oh, well, I guess there's not really anything of use in there, is it? Um, what's it? Intelligence? Yeah, there's nothing really of use in there. Although there is in the cleaning cupboard. So maybe we should make that staff only. I don't know. They can get poison. That's kind of the main thing from there. Uh, there's a huge supply as well as a huge demand for narcotics. I mean, we have a ton. Yeah, yeah, there's a, just a ton of stuff for narcotics. All right, well, we'll go ahead and place those two buildings down. That'll spend up a fair bit of our money. And did we just complete a grant? No, we didn't. Okay. We still have to wait two more days for that long-term investment to finish. And we also have to do cell block D, raise our, uh, raise our prisoner capacity to 200. That's pretty... That's not going to happen for a while, though. Um, yeah, that's really not going to happen for a while. Down. Bada bang, bada boom. Anyways, I think I'm gonna go ahead and end this one here. If you guys enjoyed this episode, be sure to leave a like, be sure to comment, and please, please, please subscribe. It really helps out and it really does mean a lot. So once again, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye bye!